Hello guys, I'm Seraphim190, welcome back to my... Shh. Hi guys, um, so yeah, today I'd like to show you guys how to get into the nether roof without ender pearls, and I'd also like to show you how to break bedrock using only these. So we have some vines collected, and we have some wool collected, and now all we need to do is get a bed. That's all you need to break bedrock. So let's go down as deep as you can where you find bedrock, and let's break them! Okay, so as you know, these are unbreakable blocks. As you can see, I'm in survival. I cannot break them! I cannot break them with my hand or my mind or my soul. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. So um, now I can put vines down, and I can whack the beds on top of the vines, so watch carefully as I do this. So when we put the vine down, I said watch carefully, okay? So when you put the vine down, you do it on the top. Left corner, see? Bang! Faction! Oh, faction me. I factioned the world. I have now glitched it out. I am now the ruler of Minecraft. <laughs> Okay, so we can break these blocks away, it's amazing. Look how much room! There's so much room for activities, and I'm very epitificent. I'm magnificent. Look at this, guys. This is great. I can actually burrow my way all the way through this wall, all the way to the other side of the world. Okay, so now I'm in the um, nether in my creative world. Now, this is the way we used to be able to get into the roof of the nether. Now, this is very cool, very easy, and um, we used to use three ender pearls. Okay, so this is the idea. So we collect three ender pearls like so. And then um then we throw three in like so and we're in. We're in, we're in the top. That's simple. So that's how it's done. Okay, so if you don't have ender pearls and <clears throat> yeah, so if you don't want to die using ender pearls, well now you don't have to because there is a way. There's a way! There's a way to get in there now, guys. So let's build a portal real quick. We've got no ender pearls. It's not what we're doing. It's not what we're about, guys. So we're going to actually do this using carts and rails. Yeah, you heard me correct. We're going to get into the roof of the nether using cart, rail, and a ladder. Okay, so let's do that. So I'm up the top right now on the roof, as far as I can go. I now have two gaps in front of me. This is what we'll work with. I'm going to put a redstone block in that gap with a powered rail on top. I'm going to make redstone block in that gap with a powered rail on top. I'm going to make the rail point down, and then I'm going to put a ladder down. So there's that block, there's the rail. Um, I can't squeeze through there, I'm a little bit wide for that. I'm going to break this block, and so I can put the track in there. So you want the track in that little corner right there like this. Perfect. Okay, so now you want to get out your cart, whack it down, doesn't matter if it falls, it's okay. Wait, it does matter, it's in the way. Okay, so get your ladder out and whack it down. And, uh, yeah, so now you put your minecart down, you just jump in your minecart, push forward towards the ladder, and keep spamming the, the exit button, the, the button that allows you to jump out of the cart. So I'm pretty sure that's R3. So, um, yeah, so you keep pressing that and look at it, and behold, I am now on the roof of a Mimu. Very good, very cool. So if you guys like this video, if you enjoyed my video, please let me know. If you don't like it, let me know why, and I'll fix it and change it and rearrange it for your own enjoyment. I'm Sarah from 190. I'll catch you guys. Peace out. Yo.